Welcome everyone, we are the Grin Brothers, and I'm the ever so selfie Solden. Because you can see in the past 19 episodes my expertise at the stealth class. And Raffi here will back me up on this. What what did you call yourself? The ever so selfie? Stealthy. <laughs> Um, also, I just saw a tweet, which you'll find funny. Apparently, Pokemon Masters has made $26 million in its first week of availability. Who's been spending that much money on it? It's free to play. It is. I don't know why it's made that much money either, because it's, you don't really need Do to... people want waifus that much? And let's be honest here, it is basically just a dating sim. Yeah, it is. 100%. Uh, and I'm not opposed to that. Um, Date all these ten year olds! Oh, okay! I'm not opposed to that. <laughs> 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 You're in the wrong country! Who cares? It's a meme! It's. Look. <laughs> all I'm saying. Brock, crash awake, you turn into. <laughs> I've got Bryce as well. Um, I do find it funny that with the build up to Pokemon Sword and Shield, Rosa has just now dominated the. Uh, art, fan art material now but it's made more entertaining because it's been retweeted by Shofu and he has added a tweet to it yeah we ain't ever getting a good Pokemon console game again <laughs> <laughs> okay press RB to poison grog barrels after Uruk's strength from it any survivors will become suspicious and start fighting amongst themselves okay okay stealth kill Uruk's okay probably to make sure you don't get seen why am I supposed to not be seen by that guy? He's literally standing up. I walk up and you kill him. I guess I. <laughs> See? Oh, wow. Wow, did I ever doubt my usual strategy? I don't know, because somehow. <laughs> This managed to work, despite your incompetence. Okay, going along, going along. Going along. Hmm. That's annoying, there's no... Oh, there's wait, someone at the top of that tower. Oh, is there? This one? Yes, it'll be an archer. Stealthy. I'm not sure how that's stealthy at that point. you think that'd make a heavy oh, sound, yeah. but I guess Italian's pretty lightweight. So, do you actually know what the things on the minimap mean? No. It's way too small for me to even be able to properly see them. Like, you, you well, really there's think a guy. With, you really think with my eyesight... Ah. Oh. Whoops. Wow. Like, I, I mean, how was I supposed to tell he was going to be there? It, oh. Carried on your bonus objective, though. No, I didn't. Look, bonus oh. of 0 out of 5. I was going to say, it said 2 out of 5. I know. Wow, that's a bit worried of them. Yeah, I have no idea. I can't see the minimap, basically. I can see my Amazing. blue icon. Okay, well, I'm not surprised, but yeah. My eyesight's deteriorated far more due to getting up at 4 o'clock in the morning to start uploads. I'd be la I'm happy if with the improved internet connection and... Um, with uh, the new laptop, we'd probably be able to upload much quicker. Yeah. So we need to, go, to um, go over the you know potential GPU and CPU and such with you about that, actually. Yeah, that's fine. I'll look up my I've, computer specs later today. Because I've had a browse uh, through the stores. Yeah. Um, you may want to give me a list from uh, game itself, though. I, yeah... Yeah. I'll do it at some point. I try I'm to glad that they that they have a tendency to doubt themselves. I see. Did, did did I see that? No, I clearly didn't. My one desire is to spend as little time as humanly possible at around or near work. Um, because it's a sinkhole. <laughs> um. Honestly, I have not much confidence in 
uh, actually getting through this after that incident of what's normally a good way to progress without anyone spotting you and suddenly wow he spotted me zip lining yeah I think it's just because you were too slow to react right in the butt right in the butt yep straight up to pooper Oh, wait. Okay, I have to wait until he's in the right spot. Who? He doesn't seem to have noticed me. I'll, I'll just go uh, wait a bit until he uh, goes back and forth around. Shouldn't I? That guy. Because he's going to turn around now. So I have to wait until he's turned around the other way now? Yeah. Um, but yeah, you were saying? Um, what was I saying? No, actually. You were talking about the Pokemon Masters trophy thing. And oh, then yeah, that. Uh, well, I can keep talking about MTG a little bit, because uh, the main deck I've managed to get working is just like this horrible, disgusting deck that I would never want to play against, uh, which is why I'm using it. Um, it's a black-white, so it's pours off colours. And it's a deck based around healing myself. And so I just kind of heal a bunch of health and slowly whittle my enemy down. Or I heal a bunch of health, then pull out the lumbering battlement and make it real big and hit hard. Yep. Um, someone almost, almost managed to uh, cause me issues because they um, used an ability that... Uh, these pacify. Oh gosh! Which is an enchantment you attach. And okay, it... so I gotta get to these spots. One right below me, but there's a guy's all along there. One underneath the bridge. Yes, yeah, it's a bit of an awkward mission. Mm. Stealth missions in general, let's be honest, they're kind of awkward. I mean, seriously, they're all there. I mean, I'd have to kill each one of them. Um, probably not. Uh, maybe go along here. Yeah, I could probably do that one. Drop the... I don't think dropping the nest counts as alerting anyone. Hmm. Would the exploding that count as alerting anyone? The fire? Yeah. Shouldn't be. Actually, there's no one there by the thing. Should be able to... Uh... Oh, there's, there's that it. guy, but you could stealth kill him. Yeah. By going through the wall. Yeah. Oh, someone's got their vision on you. No, they don't. Oh, I think it's the archer that's nearby. Hold B to drop. Hold it. And then I... Right bumper. <sighs> no wonder this stuff burns so well. <laughs> okay. Um, I just nip back right. here and whew. There's a archer. Up this one? Yeah. I think. They might be a little further ahead. A little further ahead. There they are. What? How did they spot you? Oh. Darn it. Yeah, how do I teach sneak? Yeah, I was sneaking. Oh, and I have to also get this bonus objective again as well. They've never done that. Like, they've never spotted you doing that before. No. Oh, that's annoying. Yeah. Well, I may have to do this off screen just to actually get it done. Because people have seen what happens, but... When you do it, part of it successfully. Yeah. I wouldn't mind giving it a go, actually. Ages since I've played this game. Okay. There we go. Um, okay. Yeah, so like, I I kind of got my heals going and then I was like, cool, well, I need to start doing damage. So I got my Lumbering Batman out, some cards into the XR and stuff. Um, and then they cast Pacify on my Battlement. Pacify is a two cost enchantment that you have put on an enemy and it prevents them from attacking or blocking. There's an archer nearby. There. Um, 
So effectively they turned my lumbering battlement into a really strong block that did nothing. Especially since um, it had exiled some of my own stuff, so it had just kind of been turned into a detriment. Oh wait, if I get released the caribou, that's not going to learn him, is it? I... Oh, I might as well try at this point. Caribou's going to come for you. Caribou is coming for you. Yeah, well, it's, you can get up to many places, but not the chimney, which has no hole in it. Yeah, don't question it. And the caribou's just waiting for me at this point. <laughs> My H1 control is waiting for me too! Uh, caribou should lose interest in a bit. Mm. I'm not sure if we... Oh, actually, wait, we've got a hold of episode. Yeah, you continue at NTG. But, um, yeah, it, um... But, unfortunately for them, uh, I... Did that despawn? Yes. Okay. Yes, it did. It just disintegrated. No, it didn't. I couldn't see it on the mini-map, because your character was overlooking it. Okay. Your character icon is too large. Oh, it's gone oh, into the camp. Thank gosh. Wow. Um, but yeah, then I come on, come on, come got on. lucky and I managed to sacrifice it, which then uh, brought back my other minions, and then I just brought the lumbering battleman back from the grave, put it back out, sent him back, and beat him up with it. But um, yeah, I've had quite a few people concede against my deck. Because, like, the whole principle of it is, um, just, I've got a card called Impassioned Orator. Yeah. Who, every time I play another minion, he heals me for one health. Uh, Vindictive Vampire, every time you a minion of yours dies, deal one damage to the enemy and heal one health. Um, Man, you suck about cows of. No wonder this stuff burns so well. I don't think you actually poisoned the other one. No, I think I did succeed at the poisoning. Yep, yep, yeah, you poisoned. poisoned that one, but you didn't poison the last one. No, but this is the one I needed to poison. This was the one I poisoned first time round. Yeah. Of course, it came out against it, and then. Yep, and the poison should take effect soon enough. And then they'll pick a fight with each other. Yep. And there's one just there. Oh, really? Yes. You walked right past it. That's what I was saying. Okay. When I said you didn't poison the other one. Okay, yeah, I killed the archer that was above first. Just remember, once you poison it, enemy will start coming towards it. Yeah. It's okay, I need to get up here to use the zip line. Which is the wrong direction for the zip line, okay. No, but you can walk across that. Yeah, and... I'll drop down here because they're all busy killing each other over there. Yeah. That's down. normal. Oh, <laughs> climate, so. Yeah, uh, Impassioned Orator and Vindictive Vampire. And I have a card that means every time I heal health, it heals me plus one more. Um. And she gains, she's a 2-2 two, two fly that gains plus 2-2 two, two if I've got 25 health or more. Or so. Is there a guy above my head here? Don't think so. And that's the phone. That is the phone, yes. You want me to go answer that? Yeah, yeah. <sighs> Let me just quickly look at something to talk about whilst everyone's gone. Yeah, I can't remember if I mentioned the DeviantArt thing or not, the DeviantArt situation. I know I was going to finish it off uh, from last time. Is that a human or a... That's, that's a human slave. Okay. 
So I can poison this and run up this. Come on. That is not as far as I was hoping for. Come on. Get me up here. Get me up here quick. Get me up here quick. They're going to find me otherwise. Yeah, I got the self kill bonus. Hooray! Okay, and they should eventually start killing each other over here. Ugh. I didn't get it in time, so I just fussed the dogs forever. Yeah. Um, that actually does remind me a quick little thing to finish off on. Yeah. Um, don't think I ever finished it off before, but my Deviant, that little Deviant situation, which luckily seems to have passed by without any problems, but. Uh, you know, do you spot any of them down below me? Can't see them. So I just need to poison this last one, and then I will take myself away in here. I think I can get out your poison, but. No, it did, yeah. It just took um, long time to load. But yeah, there was a DeviantArt situation where um, I was seemingly getting sort of dragged into... Why did we keep drinking it when it was clearly poison? It's the one I mentioned about Pound Pond, how um, I comment, I, uh, some Pound Pond fans ended up in a discussion with me because I commented on Zero J's Pound Pond artwork he made. What? Why is she freaked out? I don't know. I guess she just freaks out. Does Talion look like a man you trust? <laughs> um, yeah, and um, there seemed to be some sort of argument that these people were having with like another person who was trolling them sort of thing and sort of flagging some of their art, Paldi Pon artwork. Mm. And so seemingly like they're, they're, uh, I would keep being tagged into conversations of like a call to arms of fans and friends or things. Like, I spoke to you like twice, maybe. <laughs> like, But the weird thing is like, the way I think this whole situation happened is that a lot of the, uh, the sort of like f four or five people who were like these Pound Pond fans, for some reason were also like, also like anti-fans of, of like children's shows like Dora the Explorer and Peppa the Pig and that seeming, and stuff like that. And that seemingly invoke the anger of this one die-hard Dora the Explorer Peppa Pig or something fan and that's why started flagging, flagging the Pablo de Pond artwork sort of thing it's like well for stars I just don't understand why people would you know why there needs to be a whole anti-fandom sort of thing it just takes up an awful lot of energy like I dislike Spongebob but I'm not going out of my way to constantly uh, sort of like go about sort of like um, you know Doing anti SpongeBob stamp and sort of stuff like that. Anti SpongeBob propaganda. Yeah, effectively. Down with the sponge. And heck, on the pro uh, a concept of children's shows, I wouldn't actually mind uh, seeing the uh, Dora the Explorer movie. Heard it's actually fairly good. It was until basically people, uh, trolls effectively got to it. It was rating at 86% on Metacritic, so. What is it right now? Uh, I think 69. <laughs> 69. Wait, what? Oh, okay. Okay, I was about to say, wait, I got pretty far from my mission objective. Yeah, you walked um, a lot. Okay, so let's see. Uh, what to do next? Um, there's a few of these red things. Oh, yeah, that reminds me. Uh, more of an off-screen thing I want to do. Um, <sighs> let's see. The next war chief I want to kill is number 11, which means I, want I need to kill Skull for real this time. Fear of Karag... Why does he have a fear of burning? Fear of burning, fear of Karagors. That's his only weaknesses. Mm. You should check what he's in resistant to. Because you can't hurt him with range. Oh, yeah, true. Uh, resistant to range. Able to kill monsters quickly and resist them despite being scared of Karagors. Calls nearby allies. allies. Inspiring. They attack simultaneously. <sighs> Poison uh, weapons. You cannot... Dodge over his head. He can shoot multiple fires and quick grenades. Oh, and he's it. strong as heck, but I want to get him out of the way so and he can sniff you out if you try hiding. Yeah. In the bushes. But I want to get him out of the way so I don't have to deal with him uh, when I kill his. Uh, go after his boss. Dead. Jelly head. Kick! <laughs> Are we in the episode? 
Oh, we might as well at the end of the video, given I'm not going to start the next quest until <sighs> a little bit. I'm tired. I'm going to go back to bed. Um, I think I just kind of walked in front of all of them, but okay. Gee, am I even heading in the right direction? Yes, I am heading in the right direction. So, um, Like, comment, and subscribe if you're so tired and fed <laughs> up with living. <laughs> Wow, that, that's a huge part of the population nowadays. Please like, comment, subscribe if you too want to end your own life. <laughs> <laughs> uh, man, if only there wasn't, if only there was a a poison for all of the current generation. And I've cleaned your room. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Bye. Cheerio.